I mean, put it this way. If I could hop into a time machine and shave off a few decades, Jake Paul would still be schooling me in the ring. Larry Merchant? Please. I'm more like Larry the Cable Guy, trying to figure out the rules of cricket. On July 20th, the spotlight will shine on AT&T Stadium in Arlington, Texas, for an unexpected matchup. Former undisputed heavyweight champion Mike Tyson versus YouTuber-turned-boxer Jake Paul. This bout, set to air on Netflix, has stirred up a whirlwind of excitement and skepticism among boxing enthusiasts. Tyson, a symbol of boxing greatness, left an indelible mark on the sport with his explosive combinations, unparalleled speed, and raw power. Fans eagerly anticipated his fights, drawn in by the promise of knockout spectacles. Even legendary trainer Emmanuel Stewart recognized Tyson's unmatched appeal and impact on the heavyweight division. During the late 80s and early 90s, Tyson's dominance was legendary, culminating in his reign as the undisputed heavyweight champion. However, his career took a tumultuous turn following an upset loss to Buster Douglas and subsequent legal troubles. Yet he remained a formidable force in the ring, though not quite the same fighter who struck fear into opponents' hearts. Now, decades later, Tyson finds himself facing off against Jake Paul, a relatively new face in boxing who has captured attention with his unconventional journey from social media star to professional boxer. The stark age difference between the two fighters is impossible to ignore, with Tyson at 58 years old and Paul in his prime at 27. The matchup has drawn comparisons to a circus sideshow, reminiscent of Tyson's colorful second career characterized by headline-grabbing antics. Yet, there's an undeniable intrigue surrounding the event, fueled by Tyson's enduring aura and Paul's knack for generating controversy. Speculation abounds regarding the nature of the bout, whether it will be a sanctioned professional fight or a more casual exhibition. Regardless, the desire to witness Tyson's return to the ring against an unconventional opponent is undeniable. While many hope for a vintage Tyson knockout, the uncertainties of age and circumstance loom large. In the end, the Tyson-Paul showdown represents more than just a boxing match. It's a clash of eras, a convergence of past and present in the ever-evolving landscape of sports entertainment. Whether it ends in a knockout or a surprise upset, the spectacle promises to captivate audiences and spark debates for years to come. All right, let's dive into this because it's like something straight out of a comedy sketch. Picture this, Iron Mike Tyson, the OG heavyweight champ, gearing up to throw down with Jake Paul, the YouTuber who decided boxing looked like a fun hobby. It's like a crossover episode between Rocky Balboa and the cast of Vine. Now this fight's stirring up more mixed emotions than a roller coaster at an emotional roller coaster theme park. Hardcore boxing fans are rolling their eyes so hard they might get stuck facing backwards. I mean, come on, Tyson's pushing 60 and Paul's barely out of his 20s. It's like watching your grandpa challenge a TikTok influencer to a dance-off. But here's the kicker. Despite the whole thing feeling like a sideshow at the county fair, Tyson's got this timeless vibe of invincibility radiating off him like he's some kind of boxing demigod. It's like we're all living in a time warp where it's the 80s again and everyone's rocking mullets and neon spandex. Now, let's entertain the idea of a real fight breaking out. Picture Tyson, the seasoned vet, squaring up against Paul, the social media sensation who probably learned his jab from a YouTube tutorial. It's like watching a lion take on a kitten in a game of cat and mouse. Hey, but what if he knocks you out? Ooh. <laughs> um, <laughs> he sounds nervous. Just look away. <laughs> so why should we care about this bizarre matchup at all? Well, for us old school boxing fans who grew up watching Iron Mike Tyson lay waste to opponents like a wrecking ball in human form, it's like revisiting our childhood heroes. Sure, it might seem like a circus sideshow on the surface, but deep down, it's a nostalgic trip back to a time when boxing was the ultimate showdown of strength, skill, and sheer determination. So buckle up, folks, because whether this fight turns out to be a legit showdown 
or just another episode of Boxing Meets Reality TV. It's bound to be one heck of a wild ride. All right, buckle up for the ride, because this whole situation is just too absurd not to poke fun at. Picture this. Jake Paul, the YouTuber turned boxer, is stepping into the ring with none other than Iron Mike Tyson. I mean, come on, is this for real, or did someone spike the Boxing Commission's water cooler with laughing gas? So get this, Paul was basically a tiny human burrito when Tyson and Holyfield were making boxing history. Now, fast forward to 2024, and it's like Tyson's comeback tour is headlining Coachella. I've got buddies who haven't touched boxing since parachute pants were in fashion. Suddenly dusting off their old gloves just to see Tyson put a beat down on this social media sensation. It's like a cosmic joke, but hey, who am I to argue with the universe's sense of humor? And let's talk about matchups for a sec. You'd think Paul would be trading jabs with someone more seasoned, shall we say. I mean, put it this way. If I could hop into a time machine and shave off a few decades, Jake Paul would still be schooling me in the ring. Larry Merchant? Please, I'm more like Larry the Cable Guy trying to figure out the rules of cricket. But hey, in these topsy-turvy times, anything goes, right? So grab your popcorn, folks, because this is one circus sideshow you won't want to miss.